Welcome to EKG's Explain Clearly. By the end of this course, you'll have all the skills needed to confidently interpret EKGs in a systematic way. You'll understand the electrical activity represented on EKG paper that allows this process to happen, the heart to beat and cycle blood through our lungs and bodies. This is the final product. Whether or not you have experience with EKG interpretation, I think you'll find this series of videos very useful. If you understand the key foundations of how the heart works, it'll be much easier to learn and remember the nuances involved with the EKG that we'll cover later in this course. So we'll start with the anatomy and physiology of the heart, depolarization, repolarization, and then on to leads and specifics about EKG paper and how a tracing is captured. Next are specifics on EKG tracing, the P wave, the QRS complexes, the QT interval, the R to R interval, etc. We'll cover the impact of our nervous system and neurotransmitters on the heart, then onto rate, rhythm, axis, escape rhythms, PVC, bigeminy, tachyarrhythmias, ventricular tachycardia, and the key differences between ventricular tachycardia and paroxysmal supraventricular tachycardia with aberrancy the QTC, and the potentially life-threatening torsades de points, atrial fibrillation and flutter, widened QRS complexes and the various types of heart blocks, using precordial leads to hone in on certain areas of the heart, atrial enlargements and ventricular hypertrophies, acute coronary syndromes, myocardial infarction and pericarditis. We'll talk about Q waves, ST segment and T wave changes that we see with ischemia, bundle branch blocks and fascicular blocks. And then at the end, we'll put it all together and teach you how to systematically read an EKG. We'll go through a normal one first and then onto a variety of abnormal EKGs like sinus tachycardia, atrial fibrillation, multifocal atrial tachycardia, first, second, and third degree heart blocks, atrial enlargement, ventricular hypertrophies, hyperkalemia, rare anomalies, and many, many more abnormal EKGs. 